Welcome Capricorns. I'm back. Happy to be here with you guys. Let's see what's going on, all right? Um, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to click the bell to subscribe. All right, y'all don't want to miss out. As well, if you would like to book your very own personal reading, all right, that information will come across the screen or you could check the description box below. All readings are $44.44, okay? Keep in mind that these readings um, are full readings and then they also come with an additional bonus question for free, um, which is answered with the pendulum. So there's a yes or no question as is a bonus question, okay? For free, all right? If y'all hear that ticking noise, is my a fire alarm little thingy. <laughs> um, I don't know. I already changed the batteries in it. I don't know. Like tomorrow, it probably won't even do that. I don't know why it does that. Like it has fresh batteries in it. I don't know why it does that. But let's just block that out, okay? We don't need nothing getting in the way of our energy here. So we're going to tune that out. All right, so let's see what message we have for Capricorns. What message is there for Capricorns, please? Oh. I just had a feeling that either, I knew that was gonna come out. I just had a feeling that that was gonna come out. <laughs> All right, give me one more card for Capricorn, please. Give me one more card for Capricorn, please. There we go. Okay. Let's see, Capricorns. Okay, we got the sun in the reverse. The Ten of Pentacles came out sideways, but we're going we gonna to hold it up front, upright, okay? And the Two of Wands, okay? So... I feel like, let's see. Oh, what's going on, Cappies? You're dropping something. You're regretting dropping something. And now you have to start over. Okay, so it looks like something um, ended or you had to drop something. I feel like you may be feeling regrets here. Maybe there were some plans that you had that you had to... Um, you couldn't go through with it. So now you have to come up with something new is what I'm seeing here. Yeah. You're not happy about it either. You could be dealing with a Leo. I see lots of fire energy here in this reading. You could definitely be dealing with a fire sign, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries. But I see that um, maybe you feel like you're done um maybe maybe you've been out having a lot of fun okay maybe you've been feeling like you've been playing around um you know not taking things too serious but now there's a, a moment here where you could be looking at things you know looking back over a situation okay now it looks like you're going to be preparing for something new okay why is the sun card in reverse Maybe you aren't happy about your finances. This could be about your finances or this could be about your family. It could even be like a marriage, okay? But knowing Capricorns is probably about your, your finances, okay? But we'll dig a little bit more. Let's see, why is the sun card here in the reverse? The tower, yeah. You could be dealing with the Scorpio. But I feel like something, something out of the blue may have happened, okay? Something out of the blue may have happened. Okay, I see somebody had, you guys may have had a decision that needed to be made you didn't want to. Okay, oh, okay. Some of you guys, this is a fam, this is about family. Okay, this is about a family or a marriage that went sour, okay? Somebody does not want to make a decision. We got Pisces, this energy here. We got the Queen of Cups and the High Priestess. Definitely Pisces, this energy. So some of you guys could be dealing with a Pisces. But something could have been hidden or kept a secret, okay? 
and you may not be in communication with this person. We got the death card and the knight of cups, or there is like a someone inviting someone um, and someone not accepting the offer. Okay, so maybe there was an offer on the table that you did not accept. Okay, that you did not accept. Maybe you re kind of regret it. Okay, so this ten of pentacles may be in regards to marriage or um, money here. Why is the ten of pentacles here? Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? Why is the Ten of Pentacles here? The High Priestess. Okay, are you keeping a secret? Okay, are you being a mystery? Are you keeping something hidden? Your feelings, okay? You're hiding your feelings. Are you hiding your feelings from a family? I feel like some of you are tired of uh, doing things by yourself or tired of... Hmm. I feel like something is constant. Like you're tired of the back and forth. Um, there's just juggling going on, okay? And I feel like you're tired of it. Why is the high priestess? You're tired of just being keeping something a secret. Why is the high priestess here? Oh yeah. But I feel like <laughs> you definitely got a lot going on. Seven of Cups wanting to pop out again. It's in the reverse. So you don't want to, you didn't want to, you don't want to make this decision. Nine of Cups is in the reverse again. And it's something about the truth, okay? So you're keeping something a secret, possibly from a, from someone, a family or someone, or keeping a secret that you may be married or in a relationship, a long-term relationship. And you don't want to make the decision. You don't want to make the decision to, for the truth to come out, okay? You're keeping this hidden. Why is the Two of Wands here? So you're plotting. It looks like you're plotting on something. Why is the two of wands here? Okay. Nine of pentacles. It's in the reverse, though. Okay, so you're plotting. You're planning a fresh new opportunity, okay? So you, you trying to... You trying to you plotting on a, you got a scheme, of a grand scheme going on here, okay? You got something going on. Why is the Ace of Pentacles in the reverse? I definitely see, like, some new energy. You got the Ace of Pentacles and the Ace of Wands here. Some of you are definitely focused on your Pentacle. Okay, so... Some of you could be contemplating moving with the Six of Swords. It's in the reverse, okay? So there's some hesit, like you're hesitant. You're hesitating on moving forward, okay? The Empress here is motherly energy. This is wifely energy. This could be the, the other woman, but there's a feminine energy here. This There could be a pregnancy here. We got the Empress and the Star, okay? So some of you could be finding out that there's someone is pregnant, okay? But you're trying to manifest the opportunity. But I'm not sure if it's going to move forward. Let's see, why is the Six of Swords in the reverse? Page of Pentacles in the reverse. For some reason, like, for some of you, um, something that you're planning, on uh, planning on, make sure that you are fully prepared. Um, don't go half stepping. Okay. If there's something that you're ready to speak out about, I feel like for a lot of you guys, it's in regards to an opportunity. Um, some of you may be being using, um, your creativity, being very creative at this time. You may be creating something. Um, I, I feel like there's something that needs to be thought all the way through. Okay, before you move, before you make a move. Why is the Ten of Wands in the reverse?
Come with the Ten of Wands in the reverse. You you dropped something. You dropped the ball on something, okay? The Page of Cups, okay? Someone is talking too much. <laughs> um, someone may have been talking too much, okay? Someone may have been talking too much. Why is the Page of Cups here? Why is the Page of Cups here? The Nine of Pentacles. Someone may have been talk, telling too much of your business, okay? And something that you don't want somebody to know about your past. Somebody's been doing too much talking, okay? Waiting on somebody to make a decision on whether they want to leave for good. What is this, okay? Y'all contemplating on leaving or something. Why is the Five of Cups here in the reverse? There's regrets. <laughs> Oh, yeah, devil in the reverse. Oh, queen of cups, death in reverse, five of wands. You want to come out of conflict possibly with a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio? I feel like some of you guys are possibly having some type of regrets, okay? Ace of wands. This is new fresh energy, a new opportunity, a new beginning, a new start. But see, I feel like that's what you're planning. But like I said... You guys got to make sure that everything is, all your ducks is in a row before you make this, before this uh, opportunity can present itself, okay? Why is the Ace of Wands here? Why is the Ace of Wands here? Why is the Ace of Wands here? Oh, yes, the Wheel of Fortune. Oh, a new, fresh beginning, okay? And things going in your favor. So you're planning, you're making sure that when you plan, just like I said, make sure that when you make this plan, that everything, all of your ducks is in a row, okay? Make sure all of your ducks in a row. Don't move until everything is prepared and planned. Because, oh, I see a new beginning and it looks like it's going to be good, okay? Good fortune, good, good luck. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here with the Ace of Wands? Yes, this is a new start, a new beginning, and something in, in some creative endeavor, okay? May go in your favor if you plan it right. Why is the Wheel of Fortune here? Knight of Wands. Okay. I feel like you're tired of stressing. You're tired of worrying about stuff. You're trying to manifest. Okay. You're trying to manifest a new opportunity. Okay. You're trying to manifest something new. Keep in mind, too, I see lots of sexual energy here. But this is a Capricorn read. And we know that... <laughs> We know what's going on with Capricorns, but definitely lots of sexual energy. I'm not sure if you're switching partners, okay? That could be a shift, but I'm definitely feeling some type of shift, okay? Lots of, you know, sexual energy here. You could be changing partners, sexual partners, okay? Why is the devil here in the reverse? Yeah, you were... so. I feel like you're regretting something that was said, okay? You feel like somebody somebody test your gangster. <laughs> you feel like somebody tried you, okay? You feel like somebody testing you, okay? I feel like you feel like somebody testing you. Why is the high priestess here? Queen of Cups. Some of y'all are definitely dealing with a water sign, okay? I'm getting, there is like a long-term relationship or marriage here. We got the Ten of Pentacles, the Queen of Cups, and the High Priestess. Definitely Pisces energy. Mind you, this came out twice, okay? Definitely, a lot of you guys are dealing with the Pisces. And maybe there is a long-term thing here, or there is some type of investment or money or this could be like, you could be dealing with, um, I'm just getting like, there's pentacles here. So it's definitely possibly in regards to something tangible, something that you can, you know, invest in, something that may have something to do with the material. But someone here is regretting something that they said. I feel like it's you guys regretting something that you said possibly to a Pisces or a water sign about some type of money or gift or something in that nature okay i feel like you're plotting 
planning going ahead, okay? I need to see. What I'm also seeing is, too, um, somebody's juggling. Someone has some secrets. Somebody's juggling two or more people, okay? Um, it's kind of like for revenge or get back with this justice in reverse. Somebody could be dealing with the Libra. But we definitely got some jug juggling going on and some secrets, okay? We got the two of pentacles, the empress, and the moon reversed, okay? So definitely somebody got something going on on the side, okay? And I'm just getting like there was an offer on the table that somebody did not take, okay? Somebody didn't accept the offer. Yeah, somebody doesn't didn't want the offer, Okay. Why is the two of wands here? Two of wands and the seven of cups in the reverse. That came out quite a few times for y'all. Okay, somebody is just like, somebody got a lot, a lot of options, okay? Some, but some... But at the same time, I feel like there's some trickery going on, all right? But somebody's afraid to take a risk because they're afraid of getting caught. So, I feel like there's a plan here. So, you're being strategic on how you move. But you're most definitely dodging because you're trying not to get caught. Why is the seven of cups in the reverse? Star card in reverse. Be dealing with an Aquarius. But some, I'm also seeing here somebody is mad because somebody's getting all the attention. Their friend or the circle, somebody's circle is getting a lot of attention. And somebody's watching from the background. Somebody could be watching you or you watching somebody, somebody's group or entourage or something like that. And they've been, somebody's been getting some attention, okay? But what I'm also seeing here is, like, at the bottom here, I, I am seeing somebody, like, switching partners here. I'm seeing some good sex or somebody's changing, you know, changing their partner. Why is the Knight of Wands in reverse? This could really just be some really good sex. Why is the Knight of Wands here? Yeah. Be careful because we got the seven of wands here. Make sure y'all wrapping it up. Make sure y'all are protecting it, okay? All right, so let's see what else we got for Capricorn. can you mother yourself okay how can you mother yourself how can you mother yourself some of you guys may need to take some pampering time may need to take some time to get your hair done get your hair cut get your nails done um do something for you okay that's going to make you feel good about you okay some of you need to visit your mother. Some of you guys need to be around feminine energy, some, you know, a motherly energy or um, a very nurturing, calming energy, okay? So, like, some of you guys just need to feel nurtured, okay? Um, we got awakening, okay? Some of you guys may be going through an awakening. That may be what that tower moment was, okay? This was past energy where that tower card was. So maybe you guys have come to some type of realization, okay? Come to some type of awakening. Energetic upgrades, a new way of being, okay? A new way of being. Let me get one more card for Capricorn, please. Thank you. All right? Trust your path. If you knew you would be supported, what would you do? 
what would you do? And look at the bottom of the deck. We got just say yes. Okay. All right, Capricorns. Take what applies and leave the rest. If this message resonated with you, great. Make sure you leave me a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share, and subscribe for my newbies. All right. Until next time. Ciao for now.